Speaking of stars, some of the area best players hit the floor tonight in some high school hoops action, but in Buckhorn, the surprising Bucks were in action against Hazel Green in one of the area's best rivalry showdowns, and that's exactly what we saw. The student sections packed to the brim tonight to see if the Bucks could continue their impressive start to the season. But this Hazel Green team came to play. Down inside of TJ Pruitt, he fights through contact and gets the bucket to go, but the Bucks would respond. Kyler Douglas picks a pocket, takes it coast to coast, and finishes, but they weren't done. It's my man, Jeremiah Wilson from outside. The super sophomore connects. It was an impressive showing tonight as the Bucks get a big area win over the Trojans at home, 53-33. to Next up, a trip to May Jimson on Tuesday. Meanwhile, over at Scottsboro, it's the Battle of the Wildcats as the Borough hosts Gunnersville in an area showdown, and the visitors wasted no time making his statement. Brandon Fusell, top of the key three, got it. Then the quarterback shows off the passing ability, hitting Brody Perry in the corner. He's got a three of his own. And then on the fast break, it's Perry on the perimeter again. He stops, he pops, he adds another. A 9-2 run to open this one. Tyson Sexton would use his handles to help Scottsboro cut into the lead. This game was back and forth all night, and it was one to remember. But it's Guttersville that takes this one on the road, 78-76 to in an instant classic. All right, let's look at some other scores from tonight across the state. In the Times Daily Tournament, Covenant Christian took down the Rogers Pirates 47-36. While at Albertville, the Grissom Tigers gets a big win on the road over Albertville, 79-32 to in some area action. Meanwhile, on the ladies' court, the six-time defending state champion Hazel Green Trojans were on the road taking on Buckhorn tonight in front of a packed house and the Trojans looked like themselves tonight. Check out that tough basket from Leah Brooks getting a putback to go. The Trojans move to 11-0. They pick up another win, 66-36 over Buckhorn. A bit earlier in the day, an all-lady Wildcat battle took place, defeating 5A state champion Gunnersville on the road. They already had a big lead late when Laney Phillips drilled a corner three to add on, but the other Cats had some fight in them. Off the fast break, Catherine Holland with the corner splash. But on the other end, Olivia Vandergriff had another dominant night, draining the big shot to keep Gunnersville in front. They held off a late Scott Sparrow push to win 59 to 51. Taking a look at some other girls scores from tonight. Bob Jones gets a big win at the James Clemens tournament 56 to 20 while East Lawrence gets a win on the road over Falkville. For a full look at all of the area scores from both the girls and boys high school hoops action. Be sure to check out our website, waytv.com under sports. Moving our attention to the